Greetings fellow contestant, let me help you boost your overall performance and frames per second in our all time favorite game, The Culling. First of all, I only speak for myself, but generally everything that applies to me should work for you as well. I have a pretty decent PC, I will not go into detail with the specs, but it can run almost every game on good to maximum quality with solid 30 to 60 FPS using the newest GeForce driver. The culling runs with highest graphic settings and a field of view of 100 without vsync enabled that only stabilizes your FPS on 20 to 30 FPS. Not so great. Of course you can change resolution, render quality, texture quality etc. But that really should be your last option because it greatly reduces the visual quality. Switching between borderless windowed and full screen mode can help you increase FPS. There is no rule which one is better, just test it for yourself. Coming to my first actual tip, I show you how to disable shadows and remove the FPS limit. Open the run command by pressing the Windows key and R. Now enter percent app data percent and press enter. Click once on app data, then local, victory, saved, config, windows no editor and open gameusersettings.ini. You can read the path again in the description. The fourth last so-called scalable variable is shadow quality, where you insert a zero after the equal sign, save and exit the file. Stay in the same directory and open engine.ini. Add the following text to the bottom, also included in the description, save and exit the file again. Disabling the shadow brings a huge difference in the actual graphics, not only boosting your FPS, but also giving you a further view, which helps you spot enemies, funk barrels, item crates and so on. You can see the impact even in the menu, boosting my FPS from 30 to 50. My next tip is installing Unreal Engine 4 pre-requirements. The setup is already in your Steam directory. Go to your Steam library as shown and click the culling, engine, extras, reddest, n-us and click the 64 setup if you have a 64-bit operating system or the 84 setup if you have a 32-bit system. To find out what system you have, a little Google search can help. For me it is the 64 setup. After thoroughly reading and accepting the license agreements, follow the installation instructions and have another free FPS boost. By now you should have experienced a decent performance boost. I can run the culling now on highest settings at stable 50 to 60 FPS. If you still have problems with your game's performance, you should lower anti-aliasing, post-processing and in the gameplay settings your field of view. Only if that still doesn't help, lower your render and texture quality. After all these settings you should have a good frame rate, even when you don't have the best PC. I hope I could help you. And now, have a nice day fellow contestant.